Warning, this video and channel may not be suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. With that being said, hope you enjoy. You have been warned. Salutations gamers, he's okay, I'm just joking. Hello everyone, this is the official k -On Gaming HD, and welcome back to the Let's Play series that is consuming my soul. This is Let's Play number 13 of Persona 5, Royale. Hold on real quick before I get into it. Ah, gotta get me a drink of Sprite. Hey, nothing like a good old cold can of Sprite before you record a Let's Play video. Alright. Let's hold a meeting real quick before we infiltrate the palace. Now then. You're both going to get expelled if we don't steal Kamoshida's heart. I know, Morgana. We have until May 2nd. I know. Wait, ain't the board meeting on May 2nd? Yep. We're not going to get expelled immediately, you know. Let's try being a bit more careful. Let's start the strategy well meeting. then, let's go over how we're things are looking right now. We gotta steal his heart, but we don't even know where it is. Looks like we're gonna have to try looking around some first. Be extra careful about the guard shadows. Getting beaten to a pulp is the last thing we need now. Exactly. We're not having much trouble fighting, so you probably don't even need to worry about that. True. Okay, that should sum things up for the time being. Alright. Time to infiltrate the palace. All right, Let's go. Bust loose. But damn. Hmm? What's up? Nothing. I was just thinking we should choose a code name for you too. True. Can't have her going around in the metaverse using her real name. That'll have some very oh, bad effects. Name? I'm Skull. He's Joker. On both the metaverse and, and the real world. Skull, Joker, and Mona. Judging by your costume. Excuse me. I mean, she's got that tail and stuff, so. What do you think? Uh sorry if you heard my dog. Uh let's see. Cat girl, sexy cat, or kitty woman. Uh, let's go with cat girl. Wait, is that what you're going to call me from now on? I am so not down with this. Well, I mean, it's either call you by a code name or call you by your real name and cause effects here in the metaverse and the real world, which would be bad. What do you want to be Obviously. called? Obviously. Um, something better than just a little cat. Maybe... Panther? Panther? Alright. That sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? Sure. Huh? Why? Cause it sounds more... ferocious? Hmm. She's a cougar. Ha! <laughs> Morgana. Don't call me that! More importantly... Morgana oh, really she... likes Tatomic... Uh, Tatomic-y. Oh, right. Let's go. Alright, let's go. Let's start fresh and get going. It's game time from this point forward. I'll teach you guys the basics of infiltrating a palace as we go. All right. Uh, what the hell? Oh, hello. Been a while since my I've seen you. Would like a word with you. Hi, Justine. My master would like a word with you. All right. It's been a while since I've seen you three. Been a little while since I've seen you three. And I'm back inside the jail the cell. Has returned. Well done. It seems you have remembered my words. You truly make it worth rehabilitating you. What's that mean? <laughs> I am not attempting to withhold information from you. The essence of the rehabilitation that you must complete will be explained in due time. Okay. 
Once you encounter allies who share your ideals and discover your place in reality, only then will I explain it all. Such a day should not be far off. Hmm. This time, I wish to introduce you to the aid we are providing. Aid? Due to your potential in wielding the power of the wild card, you can handle more than one persona. That power holds infinite possibilities. We will assist you in nurturing. Oh, okay. So you're willing to help me out. Thank you. To that end, we oh, okay. <laughs> Do not be alarmed. Personas are personalities that exist within you. Thus, you will only be discarding old personalities to have them be reborn as new ones. All right. So basically, we're killing off old personalities to have them be reborn into new personalities that are much stronger. Okay, I got it. By discarding your old identity, you give way to a new one. Hence, we call that process execution. Alright. Think of it as the fusion of your personas. To start, select the first persona you wish to fuse. Got it. All right, we got Lovers 3 Pixie or Fool 3 RCN. Uh, let's go with Pixie. Now, before you select the second persona, oh, it's allow impossible. Me to tell you Never mind. Greatly important. Yes. Do you remember how I mentioned forming bonds with confidants? Yes, by gaining their trust, by getting your trust up with them, spending time with them, stuff like that. Personas are the power of the heart. The stronger those bonds, the stronger your personas will be. Basically meaning that I have to spend time and interact and stuff with my friends. If I don't do that and I blow them off and treat them like crap, the confident and the confidence is not going to go up, and I'm just going to end up getting my ass kicked in future fights. In other words, the effects of your bonds on execution, or fusion, if you will, are quite substantial. When you fuse a persona that shares its arcana with one of your bonds... Arcana, okay. That's how you say power. it. This will be a guiding principle for your forays into fusion. Try not to forget it. Got it. Moreover, there is one thing I must warn you about. Yes? You cannot create a persona that surpasses your current level. Alright. So, since I'm a level 5, I cannot create any persona that's above a level 5. This is because the resulting persona would be too powerful for you to handle effectively. Now then, check the fusion results and choose a persona that suits your stature. Alright. So I cannot create a persona that's a higher rank than me. Hold on. Sorry about that, everybody. Let's continue. Alright. I can p pick Listen this one. Form, your new persona is expected to take after fusion. All it's right. possible for them to inherit skills they normally wouldn't gain. These skills and specialties are distinct. Sorry from if one you another. hear background noise. Skills are traits that can be passed along through fusion. All right, confident rank one, bonus experience 157, level up. Alright, next skill, level 4, Lunge. Confirm. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Alright. Alright, let's see here. We got Zeo, which is light electric damage to one foe, chance of inflicting each shot. Light curse damage to one foe. Aiha. Sorry if I mispronounced that. Then we got Cleave. Light physical damage to one foe. And then Patra. Cures dizzy slash forget slash sleep slash hunger for one ally. Hmm.
All right. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to count it. I'm going to close my eyes. I'm going to count to 10. And after I count to 10, whichever one I land on, I'm just going to pick. All right. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. But well, let me let me retry that. I'm going too fast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, back up here at Zio. Will All it right. New power? I wonder. Are you certain this persona is acceptable? Yes. Go ahead. Girls. Let us begin. <laughs> Hello. I am Arsene. Arsene. you who exists within. Though I may disappear this moment, I shall always be at your side. We shall meet again when your fate reaches its conclusion. <laughs> All right. Goodbye for now, friend. Oh, they brought out the guillotines. Okay. Going medieval, aren't you two? Ah, oh, this is messed up. Oh. All right. I got me a new persona, though. Me, Agatheon. Sorry if I mispronounced your name, friend. I'm going to be your new mask now. Use me, use me, use me. All right, I'll use you. Behold, the Chariot Confident is awakening your persona's hidden power. Level up. Nice. Got me a new skill, Lunge. Level 4, next level 200. Wow. All right. Thank you, Caroline. Thank you, Justine. Ah, oh, how impressive. A stronger persona has been born from the body and blood of the old. It shall be your new strength. What do you mean? Its worth will be made clearer when you return to the field of battle. Gather personas and bring them here. Okay. Gather a great many, execute them, and continue to give birth to even stronger personas. Got it. Developing your powers as such will play an integral role in the stand against ruin. So that your rehabilitation goes well, we have a variety of rituals to choose in regard to executions. Okay. And depending on the effort you put in, our master might consider further development of new rituals. Cry your tears of joy, inmate. Well, I mean, you don't have to be harsh about it. I appreciate you three helping me out. It seems your rehabilitation is proceeding smoothly. A joyous fact indeed. In anticipation of this, I Ooh, have prepared okay. for you. I hope that you shall accept it. Sure. I feel a deepened connection with Igor. All right. Lamott, confident prison master, Arcana full rank two, new ability, third eye. See things normally invisible to the naked eye by pressing L2, excuse me. Nice. All right. So he gave me a sightseeing ability. Your full confidence has increased to rank 2. You will now earn more experience from Arcana Burst when fusing personas of the full Arcana. You have learned the ability Third Eye from Igor. You can now use the confident ability Third Eye. Activating Third Eye in both the real world and in the metaverse will let you see things normally hidden. Use Third Eye to reveal various hints so I can use it in the real world too. Nice. Thank you, Igor. That is a thief's skill, allowing one to tap into their sixth sense and see what is hidden in the dark. I believe you can handle it now. May you continue devoting yourself to further rehabilitation. Now then, if you have any requests, we will heed them. All right. Persona Fusion, 
Confidence in Fusion and Skill Inheritance have been added to tutorials regarding Fusion. In case I ever forget how to do it, I can go back and watch the tutorial. Alright, let me talk to you. It's me. Do you have any business with me? Please watch your tongue when you are in front of Master. Sorry. I appreciate you two, you know, executing the personas and helping me out getting stronger personas. Do you have business with me? Welcome to my velvet room. What do you need today? Alright. Create new personas or register slash summon personas. Let me check this one out. You'd like to read the compendium? These are the paths you have walked. Ooh! Alright. These are the uh, personas I got via DLC from the original Persona game. Because I did have the original Persona game, so I got a whole bunch of DLC. That's by Arcana. Let me go by level. Alright. Actually, let me go up. Why am I going down? Alright, I know Igor said not to create any personas that are higher rank than you already are. But... If these personas I have here are DLC personas and they're free, I don't have to pay anything for them. Would it be okay whipping out one of these personas? I mean, this is a level 90 right here. This is the Messiah. The next level was 48,896. Good God. 56, 56, 55, 55, and 55. Persona turned Picario after becoming the trickster's mask. He appears before Judgment Day to save the virtuous. He is a universal figure, appearing in myths around the world. I mean, I know Igor said not to create, but... These are ones that, like I said, I got three at DLC. How much did I get? Roll all the way down. Okay, I got those right there. That right there. Man, I got a lot of... <laughs> this is a lot of DLC. Alright, these are the ones I have right now. You know what? I'm probably gonna... I probably shouldn't do this. I might end up regretting this. But you know what? Screw it. Is this what you want? Fuck it. Required. This is the persona born within one who held a fate outside of yours. It bears the power of its original owner. Hence, I have no doubt it will be a great boon for you. Do you wish to summon it? Why the hell not? This is your power. You summon the Messiah Picaro. All right. Holy shit! Eighty-three thousand two hundred and twenty-five yen. Is this what you want? A persona of an. Okay. Okay. It's a level eighty-one. You know what? Why you the hell not? This persona? Yes, please. Then accept this persona. All right. This is the death one. Is this what you want? A persona turned Picario after becoming the trickster's mask, the Greek god of death. He is the son of Nyx and the twin brother of Hypnos. He is known to provide mortals with a peaceful death. You know what? You'll withdraw sure. this persona? Yes, please, Justine. This is your power. Thank you. Fifty thousand four hundred yen. This persona? Wow. Alright. I got me three badass personas right now. I think that that's good enough for me. Alright, register. You do not have any personas that need a registration. Alright. 
time for some rehabilitation. Let's execute him. Normal fusion, guillotine, fused by result. Uh... Ooh, I could fuse this one. You can't handle this. Oh, never mind. I, I complete. I completely forgot. Igor clearly said, "Do not fuse personas that are higher rank than you." I'm so sorry. Done already. I'm done. Right. Heading back already. Yes, please. No slacking off. All right. Goodbye, you three. Thank you for the help. Something wrong? You were just standing around all of a sudden. To my teammates, it looked like I wasn't moving. Why are you spacing out like that? It's kind of hard to tell what you're thinking sometimes. I was getting help from three people. Let's just say he's a man of high caliber. We're counting on you, Joker. All right. So, where do we start? Let's head to the safe room we found last time. It's Got on it. The first floor of the West Building. That's pretty close to our usual entrance. It should be a pretty decent starting point. All right. Safe room? A room where we could stay safe of enemies and stuff, and a, an area where I can also save my game. It'll make sense when you see it. Well, let's head out. All right. You can now quick travel. Bring up the map with R1 and select a previously visited safe room to go there instantly. Nice! Alright, Castle Gate, Underground Prison, West Building, First Floor. You could also quick travel from a safe room back to the palace entrance. Quick travel can only be used in these two locations. Alright. You can receive aid from allies via the Thief's Guild. This is available when infiltrating the metaverse while connected online. You can only request help a limited number of times, as the Thief skill will be able to help you out of a variety of desperate situations. Excuse me, there are no downsides to receiving aid, so be sure to use it proactively if you find yourself in trouble. Alright, uh, and she's still here. <laughs> I find it funny I'm the only one that can see you. I'm literally the only one that can see you, these three cannot see you. But thank you for helping me out. Let's do it. Let me save my game real quick. All right. Thank you for helping me out. Let's go, you three. Let's go back in here through this way. If I can. Okay, there we go. Old Castle Central Hall. Got some guards down that way. Go back through here. Open this door. Alright. Can I go back down here? No, I cannot. Locked. It ain't opening. <sighs> Ugh, we're done in there. Just thinking about that room gives me the creeps. Well, can't go that way. I got some guards here. Wait till his back's turned. Gotcha! Here we go! Bring out the gun and open fire. Come on, uh, Mana. Nice! Thank you. Come on, Skull. Nice! Whoa! Let's not be rash. Look, I won't say anything to King Kamoshida, alright? Let's talk. Uh, show me the money. Look, here's 902 yen. Just take it already. Sonny, you still don't have what it takes. Train some more and come back at, at me. Got it? Obtain 902 yen. Thank you. That's working well, right? Come on, show some appreciation. Hmm. You really think you actually stand a chance against King Kamoshida? 
Thank you for the yen, though. 1,027 yen. All right, got me some extra yen there. Seven experience. Nice. All right. I went down 30%. Good. I'll reveal your gotcha. Pixies. Alright. Let's attack using a melee weapon. Alright. Seriously, I said I'm sorry. Jeez, what should I do? Well, last time I said show me the money, I want an item this time. Oh, it's been a while. Wow. How long has it been since we split up? I guess human heart chained really easily. Oh! Falling in love again with an old flame, are you? <laughs> Why don't we talk for a bit? Alright, I suppose. This is so weird. I mean, it's not like we don't know each other. Hey! That really hurt! Ooh! What if this leaves a scar and it's permanent? Uh. You know what? I'm gonna be an asshole. Just get plastic surgery. Hey, I don't need that. Look at me. Are you blind or something? I'm getting bored of this. I guess I'll just go ahead and let you kill me. But before you do, do something funny. What can you do? Uh, Impressions. Really? You could do impressions? You're more talented than I expected. You know, we're kind of like similar. Wait, talking to you made me remember something. I'm so not a shadow that belongs here. I used to be in the human sea of souls. I'm Pixie. Nice to see you again. I mean, I'm you after all. So let's hope we get along. And I got Pixie again. Nice. Gain the Pixie mask. I got me a trophy. I am thou. Not able to read the rest of it though. But it said I am thou. No money. But I did get two experience. I'll take that. Okay. I went down 20%. Got a safe room right in front of us. Take out this guard right here. Show me your true form. All right. All right. Time to use a persona. Uh. Let's use this one, and I'll use it on you in the middle. Come on, Mana. Nice. Ah. All right. Light fire damage to one foe, chance of inflicting burn, restores low amount of HP to one ally. Let's use this one. Oh, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to restore its health. There we go, took care of it. I got me a trophy, technician. Nice. All right. You gonna talk yet? No. Never mind. Loser. Yeah! Victory! 360 yen, 12 experience. Nice. Okay. Went down 10%. Okay, we're done. Alright. Move on. Guard right in front of us. Show me your true form. And gotcha. All right. Nice. Good job. Yeah. Victory. 242 yen, 8 experience, and I got me an item, Silk Yarn. 
and I leveled up. With this power. Nice. Level six. Total experience. 0.000.314. Okay. All right. Went down to zero percent. Yawning. Let me save my game real quick. Oh. It's pretty much the school, but since we're in the metaverse, it's Kamoshida's castle. Yeah, still not getting it. Right? Well. Uh, I'm fuzzy on the details, but I think it's some kind of spot where shadows can't find us. Huh, I didn't think a place like that existed in here. So what do we do in this safe room? Take a break, duh. Oh, and we talk about stuff too. So the place is for resting up and plotting. Got it. And also for saving my game. I guess I'll rest for a bit too then. Let me know when we're ready to go out, Joker. Or ready to head out, excuse me. In safe rooms, you will be able to consult with your team members at the center table. By choosing to talk, you will be able to chat with your team members about your progress through the palace, as well as check on your party. Oh. Ah, right. The safe room discussion reminds me. This is for you. Oh, a gift. Stamina kit. Thank you, Morgana. You can only use it in safe places, but when you do, it'll take care of all the exhaustion from our past fights. We'll let you decide when to use it. Just make sure the time's right. All right. Some items such as healing four can only be used in safe rooms. You can use these items after you enter a safe room and select consult. The areas where you can use these items are limited. However, they will greatly heal your party, so use them in, in emergency situations. Well, What are you going to do, Joker? Uh, let's talk to the team. What do you want to talk about? Uh, how is everyone? Okay. I can still keep going. I think everyone else is okay, too. Everyone still seems energetic. I think we can keep exploring if you're feeling up to it. What are your thoughts? Is there anything else you want to discuss? Uh, let's continue exploring. Shall we go? Got it. Let's get going then. I should run Let me somewhere. save my game real quick. All right. You three ready? Hold on a sec. Let me talk to you. Now a safe room makes for a solid base of operations while investigating. I can't talk to Panther or Skull. All right, let's head back out. Okay, okay let's, let's get back, back to exploring. exploring. Now then. We have no idea what awaits us ahead. Here, you better take these. These fine tools have my seal of approval. Use them wisely, all right? Whoa, three times the smoke screen. One Molotov cocktail, one free spray, and one vanish ball. Press square button while investigating the metaverse to use Thief Assist, giving you access to multiple helpful functions that will aid your progress. Auto Recover uses your party's healing skills on all party members. Be aware that doing this consumes the required amount of SP. You can use also, you can also use, they messed up the text there, you can also use infiltration tools such as smoke screens to quickly flee a battle. These tools will give you an advantage during fights. Well, so far we're not having a problem fighting these things. Show me your true form. All right, here we go. Uh, let's use this. All right. Come on, Mana. Nice. Nice. One hit KO on both of them. Good job, Skull. 242 yen, eight experience, and two times the silk yarn. Okay. They were too weak to bother with. Uh oh. I'll reveal your true form. Gotcha. Alright, attack. 
Easy peasy so far, 125 yen and 5 experience. Okay. <laughs> Piece of cake! Alright. That's the way we came in, so this way. Uh oh. <sighs> oh, there's one here too. Okay, now that we expanded our roster, let's try that thing. That thing? A way for us to gain the advantage during a battle. It's called a baton path. Actually, I'll show you what I mean while we deal with this shadow. All right. Show me your true form. Baton path. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. Okay. I'll show you an example first. You better watch closely. All right. Okay. Nice one-hit KO. To baton path and swap your turn with someone else. Got it. Okay. Attack and recovery up. You can now pass the one more you've obtained to another party member. The recipient of the baton pass will have their attack power and healing ability increase. If they pass it on again, that party member stats will also increase. If you successfully pass the baton to all four people in your party, the fourth party member will be able to use a skill without using any HP or MP. Nice! Pass the baton to another party member by pressing the R2 button. Strike the enemy's weakness and give the baton pass a try. Got it. All right. The baton pass made you strong. All right. I can't use it right now. Uh... So what's my next move? Let's just, uh, open fire. Wait. Yeah, you. Well, I used a melee weapon there. Alright. Oh, okay, so that's how we do it. Okay. Nice! Seventeen experience, four hundred ninety-one yen. I got me an item, well, two items: silk yarn and plant balm. And I leveled up. Well, Morgana leveled up. Nice going. Great teamwork. I knew you guys would nail it. Improving yourselves is important, but learning to fight as a team is just as vital to our survival. By coordinating our efforts, we can take control of the battle as often as possible. Baton passes will help a lot with that. Thank you, Morgana. I'll have to get used to that, but thank you. Alright, this way. Going upstairs now. Any guards up here? Oh, there's a guard right there. And can I jump this way? No, I cannot. I see you. Damn, it. Damn, there's one here too. Oh well, guess we just gotta ambush it from behind again. Well, sure, if you want to go about it the ortho uh, the orthodox way, but there's a more stylish route. Listen up. See those sofas on the sides of the hallway? Hide behind those so you can get closer to the enemy. Once it's enraged, jump on it and rip its mask off. Whoa, that does sound pretty damn cool. Stealth. Hey, this isn't a movie. Joker, with your poise, you should be able to pull it off. Give it a try. Near cover, press the X button to hide behind it. From there, you can check out what's ahead and enemies cannot find you. If there is another hiding spot nearby, you can press the X button to jump there instantly. Also, if you are within range of an enemy, you can attack from cover for a guaranteed ambush. Make good use of this to gain the advantage. However, be aware that cover cannot be used if an enemy is already chasing you. Alright. Ambush. Your true form. Gotcha. Alright. 
Hold on. Okay, I'm sorry about that. Let's continue. I've been recording for 40 minutes, so next time I get to a safe room, I'm just going to save my game and end the video here. I'm going to pass it to you. All right. Tactical teamwork. I got me another trophy. Nice. You are a badass, Panther. 370 yen, 13 experience, and I got me Plant Balm. Okay. Sweet! That totally works! That was so cool! They totally can't spot us while we're hiding. That's right! So long as we lay low like that, enemies won't even notice us. Whenever we hide, we can take our time preparing for the next ambush. Move the R3 button to look around while hiding. Moving the L3 button lets you change the direction, face, or leap to an adjacent location. Not only can you ambush the enemy while hiding, but you can also avoid enemy contact and loot nearby treasure chests. Nice! If there are multiple adjacent locations you can move to, use left or right on the directional pad to choose your destination. You can also use the up directional pad button to focus on enemies or the down directional button to focus on treasure chests. Man, that was All right. Can I go in here? Yes, I can. No, we I cannot. Actually, the door is locked. Sorry. I spotted a shadow, Joker. I see him. Ooh. Come on, you. Come on, you three. I spotted a shadow, Joker. Hi. Hey, got me a lock collar. Let's go back into hiding now. fire damage. This is the one I used earlier. So let's try it again. There we go. Please save me. I won't tell King Kamoshida. Show me the money. There's a pixie inside you. Cool. I'll be cheering for the two of you. Oh, you want it, money? Well, I hope this is enough. 215. Excuse me. 215 yen. Had to give me something to drink. You must feel really happy that I gave you something. Well, I'm gonna go. But don't forget, this is King Kamoshida's castle. Now's the time to retreat. All right. 336 yen got me some extra yen there and six experience. Okay. All right. Anything off here I can steal? Yep. Tin claps. Joker. Look, there's something in there. Ooh. But the bars are blocking our way in. If he's protecting it this securely, it has to be important. That means there should be a way in and out of there. Joker, do you think you can solve the mystery of this room? I'm sure your observation skills will help you get through. Using third eye inside a palace can reveal hidden items and hints. Give it a try whenever you find yourself unsure of where to go next. All right. I can feel it. I see it down here. We got a lever right here too. 
pool. And that didn't do nothing. Hmm. Lock collar. I can't pull it. I've already pulled it. Focus. I'm not gonna pull that one. Pull this one. Okay, there we go. Whoa. I had to pull both the levers to open the gates. I expect it from you, Joker. Thank you. What you got here? Castle map. Hmm. What the hell? He had it all locked up and shit, but it was just some old map? You're hopeless. Don't you realize how vital a map is? Right. Now then. Having this will give us a better grasp of the uh, topography, uh, topo, <laughs> whatever of the palace. It's a true necessity for a phantom thief. This should make securing a route much easier. <laughs> Excuse me. Wait, does it say where the treasure is on there? Oh, actually it seems like this map is incomplete. There might be more of them around. Wanna get going? Okay. Let's start checking what we can. We'll probably find another map along the way somewhere. When you find a map, any areas you have not yet reached will be highlighted in red. Use L1 and R1 to view other floors. Alright. Let's go this way. Got some guards in front of us. Using a melee weapon, I'm going to attack you. Come on, Mana. Nice. Come on, Panther. Whip out the gun and fire. Nice. Thank you, Panther. 366 yen, 12 experience, and plant bomb. Alright. Good work. Keep it up. Ambush. Your true form. Gotcha. Alright, whip out the gun and fire. One hit KO. Baton pass. The skull. Nice. Losers. Nice work, team. Thank you. 365 yen, 13 experience. All right. All right. Defeated. That was easy, huh? I'll take that. An Onyx. Like the Pokemon Onyx. I can feel it. King claps. What? More bars. And the thing we need to pull is on the other side. Should we find another way? You need to train Try looking around some more. We need to find something we can use to proceed in this infiltration. Mm. Sorry if you hear my dog. Locked collar. Nothing else for me to take. Alright. Got a bunch of guards down there. I'm sorry if you hear my dog. Hold on. Uh oh. Enemy ahead. Be careful. Ambush. Alright. Uh, 
Let's use this one. I'll use it on you. All right, nice. Baton pass to you. Nice. Three hundred sixty-seven yen, twelve experience, and plant bomb. And Ryuji leveled up to level six. All right. All right. Keep it up. Thank you. Wait, that's taking me right back out to where I was at. Down to you, oh, Mana. Nice. Nice. work, team. 366 yen, 12 experience, and one item, Silk Yarn. Okay. Alright. I really need to find me a safe room. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Sixty-five yen, thirteen experience, and silk yarn. Okay. All right. Shadow defeated. Now let's push forward. Take a look at the map. All right. I need to get back to the safe room, save my game. I've been recording for quite some time. Uh oh. Crap! Uh oh. Ow! Oh! Missed! Great, it missed. Missed again. Nice. Morgana really likes the comic key. Two hundred and fifty yen, ten experience. All right. All right. There's a guard down there. Whole bunch of them. trying to get back to the safe room so I can save my game. I've been recording for quite some time. Probably gonna have to do some editing on this video. A stylish victory. Ambush. Sorry if you hear my dog. There's nothing I can do about that. Alright. Ow, ow, ow! What the hell are you doing? You know what? I've been doing money and items this whole time. Lend me your power. That's your move? Then I guess I'll talk first. I'll decide if I'm going to help you after. 
I was only passing by, and you roughed me up real bad. What's your deal, anyhow? Something bad happened in your life or something, Sonny? Uh, shut up. You youngins use that phrase too much. What are you, a broken record? Maybe it's a generation gap, but I just can't get what your deal is, Sonny. What in the hell are you trying to tell me, anyway? You're gonna die. Hey, where'd you learn that kind of crazy talk? What a coincidence. My sentiments exactly. Hey, I can't believe it. I remember now. I'm no shadow from this place. I used to be living in that there sea of the human soul. From now on, call me Bicorn. No need for honor of it, uh, honorifics, Sonny. Alright. Gain the Bicorn mask. That was incredible, Joker. Thank you. No money, but I did get two experience. Okay. And I went down to 10%. Open the door. Almost. There we go. Nice work, and Morgana hit. Uh, hit Morgana hit his head against the screen. <laughs> Two hundred and fifty yen, ten experience. All right. All right, and now down to zero percent. Are you? Don't fall behind. I have to save my game. I can rest here. All right. Let's do it. Save. Hi. How you doing, school? <laughs> Nothing feels as good as a baton pass. Hit me up anytime, all right? Sure. All right. Thief assist. Uh, yeah, sure. Would you like to perform an auto recover? Yes, please. All right. I can feel it. Nothing in here that I can take. Hi. Right. Let's open up the map. Castle Gate, Underground Prison, West Building, First Floor. stuff right there. Alright, well, that's gonna do it here for this Let's Play video of Persona 5 Royale. Still got plenty of ways to go here in the palace, but I gotta put a stop here on this Let's Play video here. Thank you all so much for watching. Stay tuned for future videos here on the official k -On Gaming HD. Peace out, everyone. Ugh, excuse me. Peace out, everyone.